Welcome to the Swim Box. This is Coach Wales from Whole Health in sunny Nottingham. Again, I can't believe how much sunshine we've had. Anyway, this is another Endless Pool Hacks. This is about hit swimming, high intensity swimming. And my training partner, Kate Vines, good old Kate CP, um, we do this a lot, at least one of our training sessions a week where we're really trying to blast high tempo swimming, short, fast stuff, Okay, sometimes we don't have a great deal of rest, sometimes we have a lot of rest, but simply it takes, we cut the session time in half and we do less swimming, but we do it at a really high intensity. So this is great if you've got one of those garden pools or an endless pool and the water's a bit cold, it's a bit fresh. So what you need is you need a pool clock, something with a second tick in hand, okay to keep time and to keep your rest time and you need either a really short bungee to make you work really hard or you need a flow that's super quick so the speed of my flow means that i'm going to stroke roughly about 50 strokes per minute and what i want to do is i want to do 10 one minutes so i know i've got to count my strokes and that is brilliant if you're doing hit swimming whether you've got a bungee or whether you've got the flow. So try and think about how many strokes you used to stroke out of a, in a 25 meter pool. And then if you're sprinting, you normally increase that stroke rate. You normally, you can add at least sort of five to 10 strokes to that. I'm gonna do 10 one minutes and I'm gonna try and do 50 strokes because I know in, in one minute I can do 50 strokes. So I'm looking at my clock and I'm going now. Looking at the clock again, straight on the clock, 10 seconds rest. Okay, I'm going go. And there you have it. I'm going to do that 10 times, going to knacker myself out, and that is a great hit session. It's all about stroke counts. The best swimmers in the world know how many strokes they take for their distances. So it's goodbye from the end of school. If you've got any comments, leave them below.